This approach could hardly be claimed as novel, crossing over conventional vehicle norms being what crossovers were always intended to do, and yet, on first inspection, the CHR seems to do it with more conviction than most. Just as it showed with the most recent Prius, Toyota is demonstrating a newfound fearlessness when it comes to design that is likely to lose it as many fans as it wins. Still, it doesn't seem unreasonable to suggest that the CHR might meet with a warmer reception from a fashion-savvy crossover-loving crowd than the latest Prius did with its largely middle-aged, moderate, conservative customer base. Underneath the skin, though, those two Toyota siblings are not so different. They share the same all-new global architecture, and the crossover also incorporates the latest version of the Petrol Electric Hybrid powertrain that made the Prius so famous in the first place. The hybrid model is partnered by a turbocharged 1.2-liter petrol option, but the car must toil against coupe, hatchback and crossover rivals without the downsized diesel motor that typically forms the backbone of two out of three sales in those segments.